I wanted this to be a really honest morning routine, so the first thing that I do most days is just grab my phone, and I was feeling pretty tired still, so I was just scrolling through Instagram. I was actually looking at pictures and videos of horses for some reason. Um, I just really love them, and so I'll kind of do something like that to just get me awake, and then I put on a meditation. Again, discard any notion that wanting money or prosperity is greedy or makes you less spiritual in some way. That is simply cultural conditioning. So this is a meditation by The Honest Guys on Abundance, and I've been loving it. I've been doing it almost every single day, so I will link it in the description if you're interested. And also, sorry for this part being a little blurry. I'm not really sure what happened here, but the rest of the video doesn't have that issue. One of my favorite ways to just slow down and enjoy the morning is making myself some coffee and I've been making espresso lately and just using that to make a latte which I have been loving. And then I usually will watch something so sometimes it'll be something on Netflix that I've already seen so that I don't like get wrapped up into it and just sit there for an hour. Um, but today I was just watching a video on productivity by Erin May Henry and then I also watched a commentary on Gilmore Girls because if you know me you know that I'm obsessed with it. And I just want this to be a reminder that like your morning routines don't have to be perfect. You don't have to like go from zero to productive like in the morning. It's okay to just enjoy your time and take things a little bit slow, especially with the way our world is right now. So I hope that this encourages you to know that that's okay. If you've been following me on Instagram lately, you will know that it's been a huge struggle for me to exercise and to get moving. And so what I've been doing is just setting up a 20 minute workout whether that's following along with a workout video or doing yoga or doing ballet and sometimes i'll just do it on my own and kind of free form whatever i want to do and i've just been focusing on how good it makes me feel and after the first couple of times of trying this that's what i remember i don't remember how annoying it is to get started i just remember that it made me feel really good in my body and that i have less back pain and things like that so so if you're struggling to do this just remember that progress is better than perfection it's okay if you skip a day it's okay if you don't finish the full 20 minutes or however long you want to set for yourself just do what you can and go from there. Okay, so the last thing that I do every single morning is manifestation work. I'd heard of this thing called scribing or scripting. As I was looking into it more and doing more research on it, I saw a lot of people say like, write the same thing that you want over and over again, but also write how you feel. So I was like, okay, so I started writing just like pages and pages of the same line pretty much every single day. So just like the same stuff. And like every now and then like my, um, sentence would change a little bit but it would still be like around the same message and so there were a couple other things related to like money and finances that I would talk about but mainly I was writing about you know life coaching and cl and my clients and like um, content creating full time and those kinds of things so I would write it over and over again but what I noticed when I did that was that I couldn't always get into like that high vibration frequency and a lot of times I would just like write the same sentence but I 
even if it started out being really grateful and like feeling like I already had it and just like feeling again kind of like that high frequency that I'm talking about after a while it would just be like I'm just literally just writing the same sentence and I didn't have any like real emotion tied to it so I was like I don't know if this is working so what I've been trying now is just like continuing to write more days in my life that are just kind of like dream days so like in the first day that I wrote about I wrote about like working with some clients and doing some content creation but then also like getting ready for a major campaign and working with my team to um, make sure that you know we have the right um, influencers for it, writing about like going to a studio, writing about like a concept of a photo shoot and things like that. And so now I think just going from that to the next day, I'm just going to write about like, what's that campaign day actually like? What is the photo shoot actually like? Um, who am I going to be working with? So that's what I'm trying to do now and I'll keep you updated. And if you do want me to make an entire video on like scripting or scribing, let me know. Um, I can also make a video on like things that I've manifested or how manifestations worked for me. So just let me know if you're interested in the comments below and I would be happy to make a video um, on that for you guys. So this is kind of the last portion of my morning routine and I like doing it last because then after this I usually just go into whatever work I have and like tackle the tasks that I have for the day. So it really just kind of pump, pumps me up because what I'm mainly manifesting and writing about is um, my business and my career and where I want to go with all of that. And so it really just kind of gets me excited to actually start working and it feels like less of a chore. It feels more like I'm really working towards my dreams and so um yeah it just adds another level of motivation to actually continue on with my day hey guys it is a little bit later in the day and i just wanted to close out this video by saying that if your mornings look nothing like this it's completely okay whether you're waking up at 5 a.m and being way more productive than i was or if you are just not feeling motivated to do anything at all and you don't have a morning routine at all that's completely fine i just wanted to share an honest morning routine with you but there is no formula or no right way to handle what's going on in the world right now. We were obviously in the middle of a huge global crisis and um, there's just no correct way to handle what's going on. So if you are spending all morning sleeping and you have no motivation to do anything other than the things that you absolutely have to do, that's completely okay. Like just don't be hard on yourself. I wanted to make this video to inspire anyone that wants to get moving or that wants to create a morning routine but this was not meant to make anyone feel guilty or make anyone feel like they are not doing enough because that is just not the truth and up until a couple of weeks ago i didn't even have a morning routine at all so if you have been struggling to get that motivation but you do want to create a routine for yourself just know that you can do it at any time and hopefully this video inspires you um, to create a routine of your own as always thank you so so much for watching i hope that you and your families are happy safe and healthy and if you do want to listen to my podcast follow me on instagram or sign up for self-worth coaching all the links to do that are down in the description description below. I am also going to be offering one-time self-worth coaching sessions and I will be offering a huge discount to anyone that is on my email list. So if you want to stay updated on that, the link to do so will also be in the description. And as always, thank you again for watching. I love you all so much. Happy healing.